Hello, welcome to lesson 51. Link you standard query operators in C Sharp brought to you by Anpro Technologies. My name is Harish. In this session, we are going to learn the Link you standard query operators. Right now, we'll understand what we learned in the previous session. In the previous session, we learned what is Link you, that is language integrated query, and also we learned the purpose of using Link you. Right now, we are going to see the demo, or we are going to learn the use of Link you. To write a query in Link you, we need some of the tools. In a sense, we need some of the operators to write a query. Okay, and in this session, we are going to see what are those operators. Okay, the first point tells you like uh, standard query operators in Link you are actually the extension methods for the enumerable and iQueryable types. Uh, we already know what is extension method, but uh, we are not familiar with what is this I enumerable and iQueryable types. Uh, we are going to learn deeply about this uh, in the coming session when we learn generics. As of now, we are just understand what is standard query operators in Link you. Coming to the second point, here you can observe there are over 50 standard query operators available in Link you that provide different functionalities like filtering, sorting, grouping, aggregation, and concatenation. In the sense, if you are querying some a list or a collection, standard Link you standard query operators are going to provide you. Uh, some of the operators based on the functionality you require. Suppose you are having a list of students. In that list of students, you want to filter the students whose age is less than 20. Then you can use the operators which come under filtering type. And if you want to sort the list, then you can use sorting types. And if you want to group the people, then you can use grouping type. And if you want to concatenate and aggregation, there are some of the operators for that purpose. But as of now, let us understand this very simple example. Here you can observe we have var students, students a variable of type var, and you can observe there some keywords highlighted in blue color. Okay, and those things, those blue color things which are highlighted, these things like from, in, where, and select, they are called the standard query operators. What we are doing here from s is a variable in what is the student list? It's a collection. We are telling that from s is a query variable in the student list what we have to do where we have to tell the query like where we have to write the query telling that where s dot age less than 20 select those people okay in order to do that in order to do this function what we are using we are using some of the operators and those operators are called standard query operators for example your where select they are the standard query operators as of now you understand like what is where and select keep in mind these are the standard query operators now I'll show you the standard query operators um, which we regularly use on no, when which we regularly use when we write a link you query as of now in this example the standard operators which we used here are where select etc now what we'll do is we'll come into the coming slide we'll jump into the coming slide and we'll see what are the other operators in the Link you okay. The following table list all the classification of standard query operators. For example, you can observe here, like uh, in the previous example, we used where and select. Okay, this where comes under the filtering type classification. Okay, and what are the other thing used? Like select. You can observe here. Where does the select comes? See your projection. The select comes under the classification of projection. Okay, these are the standard query operators which we use, uh, which we use when we write the link you query. In on, in the sense, if you want to query a collection, then we must must and should make use of this query operators. Otherwise, we can't write a query. These are the standard query operators which are available as of now uh, to write a link you query. For example, you can observe here, as I told in the previous slide, uh, if, if link you provides you with a set of functionalities, means like if you want to do filtering, sorting, grouping, aggregation, and concatenation, it provides you a set of operators, and those are uh, described here very clearly. If you want to filter from the list or a uh, database, then we can use var and off type operators. Similarly, if you want to use sort, then use order by order by order by descending, ascending, or reverse. Similarly, you can observe so many operators with the classification you can find here. And keep in mind, these are the operators which we use in our daily life to write a link you query. This is what about the standard link you query operators. And thank you for listening. Have a great day. Please subscribe to Anchor Training below.